Uh, and isn't any Christians here? Uh, not really. But sort we of. Go to a Catholic school. Aye, so did I. I used to be an altar boy. They still have altar boys. You can't help helping the priest with the wine and that yeah, during mass. So. Yeah, yeah. yeah, okay. Yeah, no, That's what I used to do. Yeah. When I was about your age, I opened up the Catholic Bible, and you know what was in there? John chapter three, verse three. And when I read it. Somebody said to me, that's the only thing that's going to get you to heaven. And it rocked my socks off when I read it. It's okay, I got them back. Now listen, this is interesting. Jesus Christ said, unless you're born again in my spirit, you cannot enter heaven. Cannot enter heaven. I thought, what? I'm part of the Catholic Church. Mum and Dad, you know, I opened the Bible the other day, all that. Yeah, didn't get a pass. Really important, guys. And people walk around like that don't know when they're going to die. I looked on the internet yesterday, 166,000 people died yesterday. Every day through 2023, 60 million of them. So I thought, I don't know when I'm going to die. I don't know where I'm going to be. If I do, I hope it's heaven. I didn't have this right in my life. I thought, I'm going to get it 100% right, no matter what. Okay? That's what God's got you here for today. He wants to get this right in your life. And it's really easy. Problem is, we all stand before God. I'm going to use you, but you stand before God one day, right? You'll be there too on our own, opens the books on your life. Every thought, every word, every deed, everything you've ever done, some of the things you never want to tell anyone about, he sees it all. No sin in heaven over here, looks at your life, sees sin on your life, you don't get a pass. Jesus Christ died on the cross, right? We know that. He took all your sin and my sin, put on himself. Beautiful gift, free gift. You can't buy it, you can only receive it. This is the one I missed. He took the sin off your life, but he gave you something back. It's called his righteousness. Puts the righteousness of God on you. When God looks at you, he sees no sin. When you're born of his spirit. No sin on you, no sin in heaven, you get a pass. Isn't that easy? But it's not automatic. If it was automatic, all these people you can see in front of you here, everyone would be automatically saved. I wouldn't need to be out here talking to anybody. He wants to get it right in your life today. It's a divine appointment, right? God has got you here. He wants to clean it up and it's really easy. He knocks on the door of your life today and he said, if anyone hears my voice, opens the door, I'll come in, I'll wash away your sin, I'll give you my righteousness, and you'll be, you'll be safe in his hand. Isn't that a wonderful thing? So he wants to do that. He wants to make you safe in his hand. Pray with me, guys. Christian brothers, we're going to pray on the street like this. We're going to bow our head before God. It gets a bit funny at this stage, but don't worry about it. Just believe, you know, you're talking to God, all right? You just bow your head, just say, Heavenly Father. Heavenly I ask Jesus into my life. I ask Jesus into my life. Come in and wash away all my sin. Come in and wash away all my sin. Give me all your righteousness. Give me all your righteousness. I believe you died for me. I believe you died for me. And that you rose again. I give you my life. I turn away from my sin. I turn away from my sin. And according to your word, I am now born of your spirit. In Jesus' name. Amen. Hey listen guys. Seems like a simple prayer, but listen to me, I can't promise you anything. God, who created heaven and earth, everything in it, including you and me, cannot lie. It's impossible for him to lie. You know what he says? He says you're safe in his hand now. You know what else he says? Once you're in his hand where you are, nobody, not even yourself, can ever pluck you out. He's got your back. That's what it was about today, right? Nothing to do with church, guys, about relationship with him. Isn't that good? Listen, anyone got a phone today? I broke my microphone, I've got to keep putting it in my pocket. This is a YouTube channel. If you take that, I'll tell you why it's important. You'll see on there in the last 90 days, young people like you, boys and girls, all giving their life to Christ. There's 800 videos on there. 2,000 people have done it in the last 90 days. The Holy Spirit is getting people safe. And now you're part of it, isn't that good? Yes. Share that with as many people as you can, all right? Good, good on you guys. God bless you. Shake my hand, big, big hard one. Ready? Now, harder, come on. Hey, when are you going to turn it on? Come on. What about you? Hard as you can. Hard, hard. Now, ready? Is that good? That's good. Okay. Good on you guys. God bless you, all right? Go and find some mates, bring them back, all right?